Hi there! Wildlife is a rather tough thing, and very often the chance of survival depends if there is a mom near the little creature or not. Sometimes the little ones are rescued by a new mom or dad, which doesn't look like his or her new children. In this video, I'll show you 10 cases of animals that adopted other species' babies. Get ready to be touched! Birth mothers do not always want to take care about their children in the animal world. Very often it happens in the zoos. Peach and Pearl, two Bengal tiger cubs, were born on the safari of parks in Germany. Their mom abandoned them just after birth. One of the zoo specialists, Jeanette Worms, took the two cuties home where they became foster children to her dog, Leon. The cubs were always keeping close to the dog, who had taken the responsible role and was trying to educate them. It's not the first time when Leon did it. He had taken his parental role with other tiger and lion cubs before. A wonderful thing happened in the park. At Bakcharisare, Kermia, Pusha the cat, which had given birth to her own kittens, decided it was not enough. The fluffy mom adopted another four children, the baby squirrels, when her owners asked her to do that. The little things had lost their mom and badly needed support. The humans made a lot of efforts to make the baby squirrel not afraid of the cat. Pusha nursed, bathed, and played with her new children as she did with her own ones, and both mom and the babies felt comfortable with that. A macaque monkey living in Cambodia found a stray puppy. Nobody knows why, but she decided to adopt it and become a real mother to the poor baby. The monkey kept the pup in her arms, carried it through the place. She was cuddling and grooming the pup with all its love. Of course, people were really surprised and regularly gave the mom and her child a lot of food. Primates do such strange things rather often, and the bonds between them and their foster children are rather strong. The monkey also had her own baby near, and it wasn't against the other species' brother. And this is one of the most extraordinary cases of trans-species parenthood. Coco the gorilla, who was famous for communicating with sign language, was also known for her big heart. When she was 44 years old, her trainer, Francine Patterson, gave her two kittens. Coco had had a foster cat child long before, in 1984. She called him All Ball, and Coco cared for the kitten as if it were a baby gorilla. There were several more kittens that Coco brought up. In 2015, she picked two new cat children. She named them Miss Black and Miss Gray, and was very gentle with them. Little Lamb was struggling to survive after her birth, and the owner took her home to warm, feed, and support. Unexpectedly, she was taken under the wing of the sheepdogs who already lived in the house. The little sheep became so attached to her new mom that spent all time beside her in her basket. When the creature grew up, she started behaving more like a dog than a sheep. Now she even tries to wag her tail and fancies nothing more than walking and hanging out daily with all of the dogs. The sheep now has an unbreakable bond with her foster mom. A family was surprised to find a litter of kittens in their chicken coop. Sadly, a cat mom didn't appear to take care of the children. So the kitten stayed with their new mother, the chicken. Of course, the little cuties needed food and support and the people did all that stuff, but the kittens didn't leave their foster mother and came to stay with her as often as possible. Dogs can just be natural moms, whether they are caring for their own babies or adopted little ones. This nice Australian brown and white boxer mom is very gentle, kind, patient and protective to her new babies, eight pink piglets. The mom amazingly started producing milk to feed her babies. Her name is Treasure, and she is a real one. The piglets are extremely lucky to have such a mom. The only one imaginable kind of relationship between a lion and an antelope is a predator-prey one. But sometimes, miracles happen. Wardens at Samburu National Park one day noticed a lioness laying down with the little oryx calf, grooming it and warding off predators. Other lionesses were constantly trying to approach the unexpected couple to take the prey away, but they couldn't. As the specialist said, it was the second antelope calf this lioness adopted. She had adopted the first one sometime before and spent with it two weeks, but hadn't managed to protect it from another lion. So that was her second foster grass-eating baby. The zoologists say the lioness was aware what her new baby was like, and she never hunted oryxes after that, changing her diet for warthogs. A baby squirrel monkey, Fedor by name, was abandoned by his mother in the Tayuman Zoo. The zookeepers decided to offer the 16-year-old Rosinka the cat to take care of the rejected little creature. The cat accepted the baby and took good care of him. 
The elderly cat was a really good mother, but she got a bit tired of the little naughty monkey and tried to make him behave in an appropriate way. Fedor stayed with his cute mom for about two months and then got back to the zoo to hang out with other squirrel monkeys. This kind-hearted golden retriever, Tessie by name, adopted this adorable spotted kitten. The leopard cub was born in the Vladivostok Zoo because her birth mom didn't want to take care of her. Tessie had her own four puppies, but she didn't reject the fifth unexpected one. She fed and licked him clean, like a real mom. This cute girl felt great and took the dog as her real mother. The little leopard stayed with his new family as long as it was possible not to let her lose the bond with her own species. That's the end of my list. Hope you felt amused. If you want to get more amused, visit the Animal Like People channel and watch the video about funny dogs and cats. They're sure to put you in a good mood. See you later!